conservation of fauna <coughs> as per existence of a variety of variety of a chapter natural vegetation and wildlife so there are a variety of a variety of a natural vegetation and a wildlife species of animals are present in our country so such species which are as a decreasing day by day due to as a human predation hunting poaching loss of habitats so such number of a species of animals they should uh, they should be as a conserve at present so for which as the government of india it enacted as a act wildlife protection act of 1972 wildlife protection act of 1972 wildlife protection act of 1972 1972 according to this act hunting is illegal in our country now as hunting killing of a wild animals as the illegal it is as illegal even <coughs> even if any any of a individual keep it will be as a caught to keeping the materials associated with the animals at their homes that person it will be as a convicted against of a law it will consider as a violation of a law means as a, if any of a individual having as the skull of animals skull of animals at their homes animals especially as a wild animals not uh, not as the normal species which are present in a our surroundings so wild animals their skull their tusk tusk of a <coughs> elephants skin of tigers horns of rhinos so such kind of a materials if caught from a, any of a individual that individual it will be as a convicted against of a law so which has marked under the wildlife protection act wildlife protection act of 1972 killing and demand of uh, animal parts it is as uh, illegal illegal in our country so through which as a uh, wildlife species of animals are protected at present second as a uh, demarcation of demarcation means to delimit demarcation of bio reserves bio reserves demarcation of bio reserves <coughs> to delimit to fix the boundaries of a forest lands the bio reserves bio reserves <coughs> such bio reserves are used to conserve and maintain the diversity and integrity of natural heritage in its full form means as a physical environment of physical environment for flora and fauna flora and fauna for which as the for which as the some certain areas are demarcated demarcated to maintain diversity and diversity and integrity of the natural heritage in its full form of physical environment where flora and fauna it can live at their natural habitats so <coughs> for which as under the such bio reserves the three three sub categories are there national parks national parks <coughs> national parks national parks refers to national parks refers to national parks refers to <coughs> sorry national parks refers to those forest lands where animals living at their natural habitats animals living at their natural habitats and human interference is allowed 
human interference means the tribes they can go towards a such forest lands for cultivation for example as a those tribal communities which are living in a adjoining parts of a sundarbans they are cultivating a land of sundarbans <coughs> they can go for a collection of a fuel wood they can go towards as the forest lands for a collection of a fuel woods fuel wood etc national parks are those forest lands where wildlife species of animals are living at their natural habitats and human interference has allowed human interference allowed example sariska rajasthan sariska in rajasthan which is known as the home of a black buck sariska s a r i s k a sariska in rajasthan corbett jim corbett jim corbett jim corbett jim corbett in uttarakhand dudwa in uttar pradesh dudwa in uttar pradesh dudwa in uttar pradesh shivpuri madhya pradesh shivpuri madhya pradesh shivpuri shivpuri madhya pradesh simli pal odisha simli pal odisha simli pal odisha periyar p e r i y a r periyar in keral periyar in keral gir forest gujarat gir forest gujarat gir forest gujarat jim corbett uttarakhand dudwa uttar pradesh shivpuri madhya pradesh simli pal odisha periyar keral gir gujarat sariska rajasthan sariska and rajasthan sariska and rajasthan done second category of a bio reserves known as the wildlife sanctuaries done this one wildlife sanctuaries second category wildlife sanctuaries wildlife sanctuaries <coughs> wildlife sanctuaries wildlife sanctuaries are wildlife sanctuaries are those wildlife sanctuaries are those forest lands those forest lands those forest lands in which animals living at their natural habitats and human interference not allowed <coughs> human interference it is not allowed wildlife sanctuaries those forest lands where the fauna living at their natural habitats animals living at their natural habitats and human interference not allowed <coughs> human interference interference not allowed human interference not allowed examples <coughs> human interference 
not allowed. First, dachi gum. Dachi gum, Jammu and Kashmir. Dachi gum, Jammu and Kashmir. Raja ji. Raja ji, Uttarakhand. <coughs> Kanha in Madhya Pradesh. Kanha in Madhya Pradesh. Kanha in <coughs> Madhya Pradesh. Kanha in Madhya Pradesh. Bandipur. Bandipur, Keral. Bandipur, Keral, etc. Bandipur, Keral, Bandipur, Keral. Next third category, bird centuries. Bird centuries. Bird centuries bird centuries bird centuries are bird centuries are those <coughs> protected areas those protected areas these are those protected forest lands Protected forest lands, protected forest lands where migratory birds, migratory birds, migratory birds coming from Central Asia. Central Asia, Central Asia towards India for breeding, Central Asia towards India, <coughs> India for breeding, B R W -E D I N G for breeding example bharatpur in rajasthan bharatpur in rajasthan bharatpur in rajasthan bharatpur in rajasthan chilika in odisha c h i l i k e chilika in Orissa, Chilika in Orissa, Bharatpur in Rajasthan, Bharatpur in Rajasthan. Clear? So, demarcation of a bio reserves through which the government, through which the government putting their efforts for a conservation of, for the conservation of wildlife species of animals till there any questions till there any questions till there any questions yes lisa sir please repeat bird centuries definition those protected lands those protected forest lands, protected forest lands, which are known for the migratory birds in such areas as the migratory birds coming from the Central Asia towards India, like Siberian crane. Example, Siberian crane. Siberian crane. Siberian crane.
साइबेरियन क्रेन एग्जाम्पल भरतपुर इन राजस्थान बी एच ए आर टी भरतपुर इन राजस्थान भरतपुर इन राजस्थान चिलिका इन उड़ीसा चिलिका इन उड़ीसा चिलिका इन उड़ीसा क्लियर चिलिका इन उड़ीसा नाउ थर्ड पॉइंट प्रोजेक्ट टाइगर प्रोजेक्ट टाइगर प्रोजेक्ट टाइगर it has been launch <clears throat> it has been launched project tiger launched project tiger launched to protect tigers to protect tigers from extinction protect tigers from extinction through this as the tigers are categorized under the endangered category <clears throat> there are a total number of 28 <clears throat> tiger reserves 28 tiger reserves which are known for a protection of a tigers from extinction protection of tigers from extinction <clears throat> protection of tigers from extinction from extinction <clears throat> next fourth national wildlife action plan national wildlife action plan national wildlife action plan this plan provide a framework it provide a framework <laughs> national action plan action national wildlife action plan provides the framework of strategy as well as program as well as program for program for program for conservation of wildlife conservation of wildlife the first national wildlife action plan initiated in 1983 initiated in 1983 and revised the new wildlife action plan in 2002 revised the new wildlife action plan on 2002 2002 2002 according to which according to which the protected area protected area network comprises the 99 national parks 99 national parks and 513 as a centuries by 513 total number of wildlife and bird centuries these protected areas these protected areas 99 national parks and 513 as a centuries yes jia sir please please repeat national wildlife action plan national wildlife action plan again i am as a repeating 
National Wildlife Action Plan, which provide as the framework of strategy, as well as the program for the conservation of a wildlife. This National Wildlife Action Plan launched in 1983 and revised in 2002. Revised in 2002, according to which, according to which, the 99 national parks, 99 national parks and 513 centuries, 513 centuries used to protect the wildlife species, wildlife species through the action plan. Through this action plan, the wildlife week is observed in India. Wildlife week is observed in India during the first week of October. During the first week of October. During the first week of October. October. During the first week of October. Clear? So as excluded for, from them as a, in a school, at the level of a school, colleges, schools, colleges, and a university level, there is awareness at the school, college, and school, college, and university level, environmental studies as a subject initiated by, initiated by the initiated by the government of India through which as awareness it can impart through the grassroots level at a childhood age. Awareness of a wildlife species of animals, their protection, it can be as an impart among the individuals. So all these as the conservation strategies supported by the government of India in relation to the protection of a wildlife species in India. This was our chapter, Natural Vegetation and Wildlife. Any questions? This was our chapter. In the first section, we discussed regarding as a factors responsible for the natural vegetation. Natural vegetation as a sunlight, <coughs> precipitation, <coughs> as altitude. Soils also, they are affecting over the sunlight. Soils, they are affecting as a growth of a vegetation. Then we discuss about the there are types of forests are there. Three types of forests are there. Reserved, protected, and unclassed. Yes, Sanshya? The week of October. It is as observed in India as the Wildlife Week. Wildlife Week. Wildlife Week. For example, as a two weeks earlier, sorry, before our vacations, that week it was as observed as the observed as the Hindi Divas. So same as the wildlife week observed in India at the first week of a first week of October. Yes, Kirtima, thorny shrubs are generally as growing in areas receiving as a scanty rainfall, low rainfall. The western slopes of Arabis are which are receiving as a less than 20 centimeters, they are also supportive for the growth of a such thorny forest. Thorny forests are adapted their harsh, hot, dry weather conditions through the deeper roots, vexy stems to reduce the process of evapotranspiration and smaller leaves and some of the trees, they adapted. They transform their, their leaves into as a spines. Example, date palm, Baboon, kicker, cactus. Any other? Any other queries? Any other questions? Click. Clear, Kirtima. <clears throat> so this was our chapter. Exercise we will do on tomorrow. Any questions regarding this chapter, natural vegetation and wildlife? Now our one chapter has remaining in a syllabus as a poverty from economics. Population chapter from a geography as deleted from the syllabus. So it means as in these examinations, the March examinations, there will be as a four chapters will be there. One drainage, second climate, third natural vegetation and wildlife, 
fourth poverty from geography and economics question last chap last chapter of economics food security also deleted only four chapters are remaining map content it will be as a ask from the these three chapters of a geography drainage climate and this chapter natural vegetation and wildlife any questions if anybody having any queries they can ask yes poverty it is a state in which a person unable to complete their basic necessities unable to complete their basic necessities so that person which can't complete their basic necessities has consider as the under poverty consider as the under poverty in this chapter we will discuss about the what are the reasons <clears throat> responsible for the poverty in india how can we estimate as a poverty estimation of a poverty as a varied from a country to country because of a because of a <clears throat> uneven distribution of yes anybody what we call to the planning commission at present roll number 13 from both the classes 9c and d 13 roll number 13 raise your hand if the 13 roll number is there they have to raise their hand in both the classes 9c and d 13 roll number 10 roll number riyanshika given the correct answer 10 roll number both the classes c and d 10 also absent 8 roll number both classes 8 roll number 9th d 4b yes 4b yes dipali niti ayog very good ansha again given as a, another correct answer ansha and riyanshika both are correct niti ayog in the year of 2014 planning commission changed their name changed into the niti ayog planning commission which was as a set up in a 1950 for a sectoral growth of economy sectoral growth means turn wise one sector primary sector then secondary sector then third tertiary sector at the time of independence our basic problem it was as a food that problem sorted out to as a green revolution clear tomorrow we will start as a first